In order to distinguish the right oscoxa from the left oscoxa, one needs to determine which side is superior, which is lateral, and which is anterior or posterior. The iliac crest is the superior portion of the oscoxa. One can feel that inside uh, one's belt line, and so clearly this is the part of the bone which faces superiorly. Obviously, the acetabulum, the socket for uh, the hip joint, must face laterally. If it faced medially, then the legs would uh, exit the hip medially, and obviously this uh, would be very different from the human condition. And then finally, if you were to sit on your hands, you can feel the ischial tuberosity on your ischium bone facing posteriorly. This is the uh, bony process to which the hamstrings attach. So if one orients an oscoxa so that the iliac crest is superior, the acetabulum is lateral, and the ischial tuberosity faces posteriorly, one can distinguish between the right and left oscoxa.